My name's Wally Trudeau. I've got a product called Wally's. It's a drywall repair tool and method for repairing small damaged drywall area. I came up with it a few years back, having to repair drywall, and I used some of the traditional methods that um, were time, you know, time consuming as well as they didn't leave the aesthetics look that, you know, that I wanted. And I just felt that you know, if there was an easier way um, to where it would be quicker and give you a better look. And that's when I came up with a drywall tool that cut a tapered hole into the drywall and then we provide a tapered plug that fits right back in. You skim over it, you can sand it, paint it, and give you a near perfect uh, repair. And so <clears throat> we've designed and developed a kit that comes with the saw, two replacement plugs, and the complete packaging Easy to assemble, put the drill, the uh, saw into the drill, cut out an area that's got damage. And the typical damage that most people are aware of is something like a doorknob. So you would use the saw to cut out a tapered hole. We provide a tapered plug that fits right back into it, skim over it. And then once you're done, you can sand it out, prime it and paint it and get a near perfect repair. Its benefits are it's a lot quicker than the traditional methods, as well as it gives you a better aesthetics than the traditional methods. Um, we have a wide variety of markets that we're trying to reach, um, from the DIY individuals to industry professionals, um, including drywall and painters, electricians that have to run and find wires, plumbers, um, security companies. So we've got a wide variety of markets that we can um, reach out to. And with that, we've created also a replacement plug in a three-pack version. And then we also have a 30-pack version for like the contractors um, that are going to use them in quantity. The saw itself can be used over and over again. Our replacement plugs are just like a consumable item. So currently, we're set up for retail. We do have our packaging in place, our manufacturing is in place. We get them manufactured in Georgia. And we uh, have our barcodes so we can get out onto the retail shelves, reach the consumers. Currently, we have them available just on our website, working with distributors, trying to get them into the warehousing and out into like paint stores, hardware stores. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Great job. So, which panelists would like to start with, with questions and critiques? What does it retail for today? Question one. Mm -hmm. Question two. If you have a smaller hole that you need to fit, mm -hmm. does this come in different sizes? It currently retails on our website at $24.95. It comes into one size currently right now. Looking to make a smaller version eventually because the insulation industry has asked for that. They cut a two and a half inch hole to insulate homes for re-insulation and they cut two to 300 holes per house. So they would like a smaller version if we could do it. Scotty? A uh, couple follow-up questions. Mm -hmm. Where is it being sold right now and how long has it been on the market? Currently on our website, we just had them manufactured this spring. Great. Yeah. Okay. Um, my, my quick two cents is it's extremely well engineered. And, and what you. I loved about what you did is, is uh, being in the world of television sales, I always think about demonstrations. But what you've done here is you've shown on your packaging how it works. And I think that's really essential because if you actively look at it, you may not quite get it. But you did a great job of showing the steps right on the packaging. Thank you. I think that's outstanding. It's an outstanding um, solution. So, you know, good luck to you. I think it's a really, really cool product that solves a problem that a lot of people have. Thank you. What kind of sales do you have up until this point? Currently, we've sold probably about 500 of them on our website and at a couple um, little home and patio shows. And, and are you, uh, you, what, what's your sales plan again? Uh, you're going to distribute it to the, user, the DIY people, but then you're also going to do a commercial play? Yes, we're looking to get with distributors, large distributors, names like Emory Jensen and Florida Hardware, where they distribute two paint and hardware stores. Great, um, Do you have any intellectual property? Yes, it is patented and the name is trademarked. You want to mark your 
there's no nothing on here about patented that I could see. It's on the uh, the front. You want it loud and proud. Oh, I see it there. Yeah. Okay. Mayor. The other thing, are you looking for any capital or investment? I, I would be open to that just due to our business plan of growth um, and our business plan of, you know, eventually purchasing a building, hiring employees. Part of our marketing to that would be uh, reaching out, in, which there was a lot of groups here, veterans, um, the disability programs that, that would be available. We have a lot of steps in our process that we could use um, different individuals that are looking for work. Uh, I've done some drywall work, and um, I can personally tell you I wish this was around a while back because uh, I had to actually hire somebody to come in and fix what I did because it is a real skill, and this simplifies that process. So well done. Thank you. Good thinking. You solved the problem. There's a serious problem out there for this, especially for the rental industry. The rental industry, people tear up houses, and if I was a landlord, I would have a whole bunch of these in my whatever vehicle or my maintenance guys. Thank you. Just so you guys know, too, uh, we have a United Inventors Association area of, of about 25 inventors back at the far end of the hall. So if you want to meet Wally later and, and talk to him more, come on over and stop by his booth. And Wally, I just want to also add, I've known you for a long time. You put a lot of effort. When did you start this project and how much time have you put into it so far? Well, there's been some challenges of personal life, business life, but I've been grinding at it for a good eight years. Yeah. Hey, there's, there's no easy... No easy path on this inventing world, folks, so no, thank you. A lot of friends, I've told them it's been much harder than I expected. Yeah. Well, you've done a great job. Awesome. Thank you. Thanks for coming. Hey, all Wally, right, we're all set. Wally, okay. one last quick thing, mm -hmm. to, just to piggyback on the shameless UIA plug. We also run an inventor's corner at the National Hardware Show, and this, you've got to go to that show. I mean, we are big, everyone up here is big trade show people. We do this circuit all over the country, and that's one of the biggest, and it, it's, it's a very moderate cost of entry to get into that inventors area and I cannot possibly recommend that enough. There are buyers, I think you'll you'll agree there are buyers from all over the country there and they're just scouring that inventors area. So National Hardware Show it's in May in Las Vegas.